Neil Young speaking to the cross end away. Neil, a very good nil nil. Do you think, in your opinion? I think at home, you know, you got to be looking to win football matches. You know, I thought we started really well. Um, first 20, 25 minutes, we we're on top. Didn't create a great deal. Probably had two or three shots in the game. Um, obviously lost Kenny, who was key to what we were doing. Um, and then obviously um, we lost the man in the second half. And I thought once we went down to ten men, we were actually better in terms of our passing, our moving. Um, but we haven't created enough for me at all. Um, you know that's the biggest disappointment. The players are had to work with some serious weather conditions today. Atrocious rain. Has that had an impact at all on the game plan and how the players have been able to perform today? I don't think so. Both teams have got to play in it, haven't they? You know, um, I just thought at times when we got in the final third, we made the wrong decisions or poor decisions. You know, I can't, I can't, um, I can't blame. You know, the attitude, the commitment, the effort's been fantastic. You know, I just think the final third we've got to be better to, you know, to create more opportunities. Do you see yourself being able to take many positives out of today's nil-nil? Take positives that we went down to ten men. We played some good stuff at times. You know, you always take positives from a game. I just, as I say, I just think that the biggest negative was that when we did get in the final third, we made the wrong choice. Um, but you know, when we've gone down to ten men, it is difficult. Marine have been on some think of a bit of a roll at the moment with a fantastic wins away at Bracken in the FA Cup, and then a what is a good nil-nil today, a really good team performance. Looking ahead to Gainsborough Trinity on Tuesday, do you expect more of the same from the players? Well, since I've been in, I don't think they've lacked anything in their attitude. You know, we've got some coming up against some real good teams, Gainsborough obviously, and then Salford. So, but we don't lack anything in, in in effort, as I say. You know, we've just got to make better decisions in the final third. Biggest issue we've got at the moment, obviously, you're playing every Saturday, Tuesday. There's a lot of fatigue in there. We're getting lads with injuries now. Obviously, we've got a couple of suspensions heading our way. So, you know, all the lads who haven't been playing, you know, it's an opportunity to them for them to stand up and show me what they can do. Craig Carney is now going to be missing for the next three games. Will this impact at all on how the team progresses going forward? Well, Craig's a good player. You know, he's got lots of energy. But, you know, we've got um, young Tony on the bench today. We've got Liam Hines on the bench. We've got Jerry Kinsella coming back from injury. He'll be fifth for Tuesday. So we've got plenty of options, as I said earlier. You know, it's up to them lads now to say, right, I'm going to put, I'm going to put my name in there and I want to play every week. That's wonderful. Thank you very much. We look forward to Tuesday. Thank you very much. Thanks Neil so much. Young. Cheers.